by adopting a counter-cyclical investment strategy, Transnet continues to play its critical role as a catalyst in the South African economy, particularly during times of dampened economic environment. In the 2012-2013 financial year, Transnet spent 27.5 billion rand in capital projects, an increase of 23.4% from last year's spend of 22.4 billion rand. This year, the company should invest 37 billion rand into the South African economy, which is unprecedented in the history of the company. Of course, I have raised with the board the need to ensure that we drastically reduce underspending and try to spend most of our capital budget for the year, notwithstanding objective factors which might lead to unavoidable underspending. While this continued aggressive spend on capital projects is aimed at ensuring that the company provides capacity ahead of demand, the spend is used to drive job creation transformation and localization imperatives in the country, thereby maximizing the economic impact of the company. We are going to continue with uh, counter-cyclical capacity creation. The market demand strategy is no longer 300 billion. It is now 307.5 billion over seven years. What we have done is that because there are six years remaining and we have spent 27 billion in the first year. We have added another year, and we are spending more than 27 billion in the last year. So another 30 odd billion in the last year. So we have a seven year program. So there were questions that were asked by how much will you adjust the market demand strategy uh, depending on the performance of the economy and so on. And so this is the impact on the original announcement of the market demand strategy. Our plans have changed, but the changes are very, very marginal. But more significantly, we have added another 30 billion onto the outer year. On the revised GDP, GDP growth forecast that we've included in MDS, um, on the presentation that Brian had done, we actually assumed a moderate growth outlook for the first three years of MDS. And on the GDP side, we've assumed around 3% for the first three years. Um, and obviously, to the latter part of the um, MDS, uh, on the latter part of the four years, we've got more aggressive um, on the growth forecasts. Uh, and that's taking into account the fact that the economic cycle we expect, or the downturn in the economic cycle we expect to actually last between uh, 24 and 36 months. Uh, how sensitive the uh, <clears throat> the volume forecasts are to MDS? I think the, I mean it's logical to to assume that it is very very sensitive, um, and the way we've actually made up the differences in terms of being able to continue with MDS on a counter cyclical basis and still uh, maintain the the critical ratios is that we've adopted a revenue diversification strategy, um, cost optimization, as well as a capital optimization uh, program. Uh, which we hope that will deliver in, um, <coughs> benefits I mean the to elevators. us uh, as planned, we which will allow us to continue with the investment cycle, with the investment, the planned investments. And um, as we say, as I said, one of the initiatives that we did use was revenue diversification, and Africa does <coughs> play a role in that. And the, the total uh, value of uh, revenue diversification initiatives that we've included in the plan over the seven years is in the region of about 10 to 15 billion. Um, and that's not only Africa, but also other revenue diversification initiatives. You'll remember that our GDP growth forecast for the previous year, the year that has just ended on which we're reporting, was 3%. And that was not achieved. I mean, we came in at about 2 or maybe just under 2 and uh, And yet, and this is precisely why we say the MDS is counter-cyclical. We are going to continue to invest because we're not investing for now or for demand now with investing for the next 30 years or 50 years because that is the nature of the assets that we're buying uh, have a 50 year life so you can't change investment decisions based on um, uh, 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 short term uh, growth cycles so this is a demonstration of uh, us proceeding uh, 